start with two cups diced onion. I happen to have some red onion left over from a previous recipe, so mine is a mixture of yellow and red onion. You could use white onion, even shallots, as long as it's in the onion family. Brown those onions in some olive oil and butter, along with a few cloves of peeled diced garlic. Pull the onions off the stove top. We'll just spoon those into a container. Then we take two cups sour cream, one cup mayonnaise, the sauteed onion and garlic and the butter and oil, one cup of cooked diced bacon, a quarter cup green onion, a little bit of sea salt, a little black pepper. Mix that up and refrigerate for a few hours. I took the dip out of the fridge and I have it in a platter filled with pretzels. Let's give it a try. Oh. Oh, that is so good. You know, if you're buying your dips at the grocery store, you're getting preservatives and it certainly isn't fresh. I've included fresh garlic, green, yellow, and red onion, fresh bacon, mayo, sour cream, salt, and pepper, and it tastes wonderful. It's ice cold, and if you're talking pretzels, nobody does it like Snyder of Berlin. They make the best pretzels and potato chips in the snack food industry. Thanks for joining me today. If you haven't subscribed to my videos, please do so. Also, check me out at RockyMountainMeatHunter.com. And what's a game day celebration without Zubas? Until next time, this is the Rocky Mountain Meat Hunter saying praise the Lord and pass the epic game day pretzel dip. Are you going to leave any for the rest of us? <laughs>